Did you know there's an animal that doesn't have teeth but can still eat up to 30,000 insects in a single day? Meet the giant anteater, a creature so specialized and so bizarre that it looks like it was stitched together from spare animal parts. When you first see a giant anteater it's hard to know where to look. It has a long, narrow snout like a vacuum cleaner, shaggy fur with bold black and white markings, and a massive, bushy tail that looks bigger than the animal itself. Standing on all fours it can be over 7 feet long from snout to tail, making it the largest of all anteaters. But the strangest thing isn't how it looks, it's how it eats. Inside that narrow snout hides one of the weirdest tongues in the animal kingdom. The giant anteater's tongue can stretch more than two feet long, coated with sticky saliva that traps ants and termites like glue. Even more astonishing, it flicks in and out up to 150 times per minute, snapping up insects faster than your eye can follow. The tongue is so long it doesn't even attach to the skull. Instead it's anchored all the way down near the sternum, giving it room to stretch far beyond what looks possible. Imagine a dog suddenly licking peanut butter from across the table. That's the anteater's level of reach. The giant anteater has no teeth at all. Instead, once the tongue flicks insects into its mouth, the animal swallows them whole. Powerful stomach muscles grind the bugs against hardened folds inside its belly, with help from swallowed sand and dirt. Its digestive system is built to break down the tough exoskeletons of ants and termites, making it one of the most efficient insect eaters on Earth. It's the ultimate specialist, designed for one food source, and one food source only. Ants and termites don't give up easily. Their nests can be underground fortresses or towering mounds as hard as cement. The anteater, however, comes armed with sharp curved claws as long as knives. With these claws, it rips open nests in seconds. But here's the trick. The anteater never destroys the entire mound. Instead it eats quickly, just enough to grab thousands of insects, and then moves on. Why? Because if it wiped out the whole colony it would lose its food source. By snacking and leaving it ensures there will always be more ants and termites tomorrow. Unlike tree-dwelling tamanduas or the silky anteater, the giant anteater lives entirely on the ground. It prefers open grasslands, forests, and savannas in Central and South America. Its huge tail isn't just for looks. When resting the anteater curls up and uses the tail as a blanket to keep warm, or as camouflage against predators. During the heat of the day it often hides in shade, since its low metabolism and specialized diet mean it doesn't waste much energy. Giant anteaters have a very unusual way of walking. Because their claws are so long and sharp, they can't place their hands flat on the ground. Instead they curl their claws inward and walk on their knuckles almost like a gorilla. This gives them a strange lumbering gait that makes them look awkward, until you see them rip open a termite mound with terrifying speed. Despite their insect-only diet, giant anteaters are no pushovers. If threatened by jaguars or pumas, they rear up on their hind legs, using their powerful forelimbs as weapons. One swipe of those claws can deliver a fatal wound. Locals in South America even say it's best to avoid cornering an anteater, because once it grabs hold, it won't let go. In fact, anteaters have been known to injure or even kill large predators when forced to fight. One of the most endearing sights in the animal kingdom is a baby giant anteater riding on its mother's back. From birth, the baby clings tightly to her fur, and its black and white markings align with hers, making the two look like one larger animal. This clever camouflage protects the baby while allowing the mother to forage without slowing down. The youngster may ride along for up to a year, only gradually venturing off on its own once it's strong enough. The giant anteater is a perfect example of extreme specialization. While most mammals adapt to eat a wide range of foods, anteaters have evolved in the opposite direction. Everything about their body is designed to exploit one single food source. From their long nose, sticky tongue, toothless jaws, and sharp claws, every feature points toward one purpose, harvesting ants and termites. It's a risky strategy, but one that has allowed them to thrive in their niche for millions of years. So, the next time you see an ant crawling on your kitchen counter, Imagine an animal that could slurp it up in less than a heartbeat, and repeat that tens of thousands of times a day. The giant anteater may look like a misfit but it's a masterpiece of adaptation, strange, specialized, and unstoppable in the world of insects.